what is going on guys, EK Drifter 458 here and today we are back in GTA 5 with another custom car build. Now this car was suggested by a lot of you but one of them stuck out. Um, it is from the Amateur Assassins, that is their name and uh, he said that his friend Adam has got a camper van just like this, maybe not as rusty obviously. Um, and he says if you could do a shout out for him and his channel I think so yeah shout out to the amateur assassins and Jack I think the name is I think it's no it's Adam what am I saying it's Adam sorry Adam uh, but if you are watching yeah big thumbs up to you for requesting this so yeah it's the Volkswagen camper van and we're going to go straight ahead and customise it now I've always always loved the camper van me and my friend EK Road on us um, we've always wanted to get the Volkswagen camper van in Forza, but unfortunately it's not happened yet. But hopefully it'll happen in uh, Forza Motorsport 5. Because I mean, they've got the graphics to make it really, really good. Now, this is, this is going to be quite cool if there's an actual turbo for this car. I'll just make it that horn. <laughs> Ooh, yeah, Xeon lights in a camper van. Right, respray. This is the bit he was talking about. Right, primary colour, metallic. And he says uh, that his car was blue, so. And I'll, I'll only too happy to agree with that because you guys know I love blue cars. Looks quite good in yellow, though. Midnight blue. Ooh, Saxon blue. Uh, but I think we'll go with the Saxon blue. I don't know. Yeah, Saxon blue. Then the top one is meant to be white, so frost white. There we go. That looks pretty damn nice. Yeah, guys, I also wanted to talk about um, the fact that you've got me over 700 subscribers. And it's growing by the day. I can't believe how uh, this series alone has grown my channel quite a lot. So it's it's amazing. Thank you so much, guys. And I know you guys want to see more and more of these episodes. It is a bit stressful at times trying to get them out. So I have made a numbered list. So this was at number one. The next one is going to be the Lotus Elise slash Tesla, uh, which is the... I don't know what you call it, the, the Voltic, I think that's what it's called, and so on and so forth. If you follow me on Facebook, I will put the the actual list on Facebook of the 21 cars, I think it says, 21 cars, so... Actually, it looks quite good with the Duke rims. Red, I think we're just going to go for a white with this. Midnight purple? No, I don't want white. I want white. Where's the white? Candy red. Candy red, Jesus. Yeah, that funtage I made last night, uh, or if this if this video goes out on Saturday, um, on Thursday night, is honestly one of the best videos I've done. It's in GTA, I know. I loved it. Right, so there we go guys, that is the build for the Volkswagen camper van and we don't really need to find a road for this one because I think we're just going to go cruising around sandy shores because we haven't done that yet. Um, so yeah, <laughs> I love, this is probably my favourite area of the game, is out where Trevor lives, there's a prison there obviously but, and the bad thing is it started raining <laughs> so it's going to be a bit slippy. Now, I would be worried if it was in a supercar, uh, like the Cheetah, for example. There's, there's still tons of different types of car to do. There's several supercars to do. A lot of you have been saying do an off-road car, like a Toyota Hilux. That will be coming in two episodes from now. So, I will, I will that can't speak today. Uh, I will be doing the Toyota Hilux or the Rebel 4x4, it's called. I'll try and find one of them for you guys. 
Um, and then further down the line, I want to try and do a quad bike. That would be really, really fun. That would be really fun. And see that car just past us there? I know it sounds quite um, stupid, but I want to do up an RV. That would be pretty funny. Speaking of that, oh god, wolf. Ah, was that a wolf or a coyote? I'm not too sure. Turn the lights on. Let me turn the lights on. Oh Jesus. Ah, it looks so nice. Drift it, drift it around the corner. This thing is rear engines, so if you go over a jump, make sure you do not land on the back of it. And one way to test that is brake, brake, brake. Oh, it's got good brakes. <laughs> Oh, there we go. This is the Toyota that I'm going to do. Oh my god. Now that's where a lot of people... I just wanted to see this deal. A lot of people have been saying where you get the Sabre GT from. Now, you get that in Polito Bay or round about Franklin's old neighbourhood. Um, where he was going... He was hanging out with Lamar. It's round about there. You get the Sabre GT because I had a ton of questions on that video saying, where do I find them, where do I find them, so, yeah, that is the location where you can find it, and for the camper van, it is quite rare, but if you drive around Sandy, oh, right, here, here's me saying it's quite rare, and another one ironically drives past, <laughs> no, it normally, it's, it's not that rare around TR because it is Sandy Shores, but in the city, you're not going to find one. Hey guys, what's up? Um, now I know that's might sound weird, but my audio actually just failed after I said uh, the city thing there. Uh, so this is just a pre-recorded message, just to uh, just to continue on, basically saying, yeah, this was the camper van. Um, and if you guys enjoyed it, please leave a like, comment, share, and subscribe. Leave the car you want to see down below. Um, and, and the next episode will be the Voltic electric car, which is basically a Tesla. And yeah, I'll see you next time, guys. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye.